Oh, hey there. What's this? What's this? You guys, I am so excited because I finally finished redoing my dorm and now I really love it. It's so cozy and I'm really excited to show you all how I decorated my dorm room. Also, you guys, I am so insanely happy. This is my first week back for my second semester of college and I've just been doing so much this week. I have so much in my brain right now. I just want to share with you all how my life is going, but that is not why you're here for this video. You're here to see my humble abode. So I guess we'll just go ahead and get started with this dorm room tour. Oh wait, hold on a second, I almost forgot. If you're new to my channel, hi, my name is Meg. I'm a freshman marketing major. Wait, wrong introduction, sorry. I make beauty, fashion, and lifestyle videos here on YouTube, or at least I think that's what you consider the type of videos I make. I don't know, I'll let you figure it out for yourself, but I would really appreciate if you hit that subscribe button. Then you'll know every time I upload a new video, I upload every Sundays, and I'm just a girl who loves talking to a camera sitting in her room by herself. Man, my life sounds lonely. Okay, anyways, that's enough of me talking. Let's just go ahead and get started with this grand tour. Well, hi again. You ready for that tour? Come on in. Okay, let's just ignore the fact that my makeup, not that great today. But anyways, this is what my room looks like when you first walk in. I have my desk to the left of my room, the way you're facing, my right, your left. Also, you guys, I live in a suite styled um, like residence hall, so I don't share a room with my roommate. I share a suite with her So I pretty much get my own room, which is really nice And I like just working at my desk in my dorm because I feel like I can get more stuff done When I have like all of my resources available, especially because I do have a printer in my dorm as well Sorry if the lighting keeps changing the window is behind me, so I'm very backlit I can't really help that right now though because that's just the way that my dorm is set up. So again, here is my desk. I just have my schoolwork down here. I have my planner on my desk. I always like to keep that on my desk. Um, and yeah, that way I just know what homework I have to do for the night and all of that fun stuff. In here, okay, just ignore this. I have my camera battery charging right now. But in here, I like to keep some, um, like my calculator, a hole punch, stapler, tape, all of that fun stuff. I also have this, okay, I have this fortune cookie from Panda Express. It's really kind of gross at this point. But my parents and I went to Panda Express um, after move-in, so... This was like my last meal with them before I moved into college, so I just kept the fortune cookie. Kind of sappy, I know. And I also, over here, I usually, I don't really keep much, but um, I do have a notebook here right now. Here's my printer on top. I just have these little to-do note kind of things. It, they're like from Target. They just say take notes on them. Basically just a notepad, which is really nice. Um, and then over here, I have some fun stuff. So I have this flute, which my friend actually gave me. You probably know Catherine. She's been in a video or two. Um, so this is a flute that she bought in Haiti, I think, when she went on a cruise last summer. It's really cute because it's mint green. I'll show you closer what it looks like. It's mint green and we were talking so much last year about college and then about like our color schemes for a room and she knew that my color scheme was like white, gray, green, and pink. So she got me a green flute, which was so thoughtful of her. She also got me this little oyster. Um, it keeps breaking, which is frustrating, but it's an oyster shell that she spray painted gold. And she put a Polaroid of her and I at the beach inside and the Polaroid keeps coming off. That's a different story. I also have this sign back here that says, live the life. If you saw my DIY dorm room decor video, um, you saw that I made this and I was originally going to put it above, like on the wall or something, 
but I really like it here. It works well. It looks good. The only problem with it being here is if I print something out from my printer and it's like a thick stack of papers and then I go and try and hole punch it and I like slam down on it on the desk when this whole thing falls over and it's kind of loud so I apologize to my neighbors below me but you gotta do what you gotta do, right? I also have this little succulent plant that was actually in my room at home and then I stole it from myself, I guess, and I brought it. So it just looks like this. It's really cute. It's from Michaels. And then next to that, I have my Polaroid, which you can see is white. And I just think all of these colors look very, very nice together. And then this is kind of gross. I don't usually keep this like out on display, but here are my makeup brushes. I used to have these on my windowsill in my room, but now that my bed is pushed up against the wall, it's kind of a struggle just to like get my makeup brushes when I want to use them. So I just put them up here when I get lazy and I don't feel like climbing over my bed to get to my makeup brushes. All right, so I don't know if this is interesting for you guys or not, but underneath my desk, I just have like random things. And then my backpack, um, you can see like the end of my phone charger, very aesthetically pleasing, I know. And then over here, I just have a little pink wooden crate, which was also part of my DIY room decor video. And in it, I just put a bunch of stuff from home and then some journals and fun stuff like that. Now on to more exciting things. This window is brighter than my future, why? Oh, I forgot to show you something above my desk, let's go. Okay guys, my apologies, why didn't you say anything? But I also have this canvas up here. Yeah, yeah, up there. Um, that's also from my DIY room decor video. I know I feel like I'm just like promoting myself so much, but I made a video and I made those DIYs specifically for my dorm room, so don't come for me. Um, but yeah, this is just a canvas that I made, obviously, because I put it in a DIY room decor video. Okay. <sighs> okay, so this canvas, as you can see, it has some coordinates on it, and these are the coordinates of my birthplace in China. Okay, like I said before, I pushed my bed up against the window. Actually, I don't know if I made that super clear before, but when I was, um, I like redecorated my room, I kind of moved around some furniture. So my bed used to be on this wall over here, the wall opposite from my desk, but I decided to move it up against the window. It really helped open up the room a lot and I just think it's really cozy. Um, so my comforter is actually, it's like a comforter and then a duvet cover. They're both from Target. I was hoping this duvet cover was a little bit more like a bluish gray. That's what it looked like on Target's website, but Target kind of filters their pictures a little bit for their website. So definitely check things out in store to see what the true color of something is because you might be a little bit surprised. Um, I don't know, it's so cute though. And then this blanket is from TJ Maxx. It's so soft, I wish you guys could feel it. It's seriously the best thing ever. Um, and then yeah, I have pillows up on my bed. Both the pillows are from Target. They're like the $3 pillows and um, I have white sheets. So then up here, I decided to do a little Polaroid wall. So I have some fun Polaroids of my family, lots of Polaroids of my dog. I love my dog and I am obsessed with him. This canvas, my friend Catherine, you might have heard me talk about her before. She actually made this for me. I saw a picture on Pinterest of something like this and I tried to recreate it, but I am not like super crafty. I know my DIYs might make it seem like I'm kind of crafty, but the reality behind those DIYs is that I fail at a lot of them and then I turn them into something a little bit easier. And underneath my bed, I have this set of three drawers which came in the dorm already. And I keep all of my clothes in my closet, but I have like my tech stuff in here, book supplies, random makeup and beauty things in there. Now onto this wall, I have a tapestry hung up. I actually um, hung it up using like Velcro command strips and now you can't see me, now you can. And the reason why I put this up here is 
Well, mainly it like adds a lot of color to my room, but also if I'm filming videos, I have more backgrounds that I can choose from. Like I can use this as a background, I can use my Polaroid wall as a background, or I can take this off my wall and just use a white-ish wall as my background. So yeah, that's why I have this here. This floor light is my friend. His name is Lighty. Um, this is from Target. This is the last thing in my room. It's just a nightlight slash wax melt thing. Yeah, it's from Amazon. My tapestry is also from Amazon. They were about $15 each, so I'll have those linked down below in case you're interested in buying them. Um, it says Home Sweet Home on it, which I thought was really cute. Even though I don't necessarily really consider this my home, but... Maybe I should make one that says dorm sweet dorm. No, okay. By the way, I forgot to mention this wall. This is just my closet. The closet doors are mirrored sliding doors, so that's it. Nothing's too interesting. That's a wrap on my dorm room tour. I'm not really sure why I was so hyper today, to be honest. But I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please give it a huge thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos from me and I'll talk to you all in my next video. Bye guys!